Our campaigning is well underway for the 2020 presidential election with many Idahoans now getting involved. Today, supporters for Senator Bernie Sanders and President Trump came out in Boise to voice their opinions ahead of the presidential primary. Six on your side's Morgan McCollum takes us there. We've got a, a big March for Bernie happening. Uh, it's called the Boise Bernie Fest. Bernie Sanders' campaign here is leading on the topic of, of democratic socialism. And I believe that a lot of Americans that are supporting Bernie Sanders don't have a correct concept of what that really is. There will be a small group of, of counter protesters here. Uh, and, you know, we welcome uh, different voices to, to come and, and be heard here. You know, we're not going to engage in any sort of negative way with those folks uh, because in order for a democracy to work, you have to have multiple different points of view. So, you know, we're, we're happy to have them here. During World War II, a lot of brave men and women laid down life and limb, blood, sweat, tears to make sure that we would have our freedom. And I don't want to see that democratically being voted away. And that's why I'm trying to bring awareness here in as peaceful and as educational a way as possible. It can feel like a big struggle to want to be engaged because it's really easy to, to not be, uh, but it's really important in order to, to make your voice heard. Well, supporters of Senator Elizabeth Warren canvassed for Idaho votes today. They were joined by Idaho State Representative Ilana Rubel, who is the minority leader in the House and was a student of Elizabeth Warren's during her time at Harvard Law. I first had her as a professor in 1995 when she was completely unheard of. Um, she was, I had just come into the, to, to Harvard University Law School um, and she, it was, I didn't know what party she was. I didn't know she was a Republican or a Democrat. I don't think anybody dreamed she was ever going to be in public office. Rubel is not officially endorsing Warren as we approach the upcoming election and says she has no plans to endorse, endorse anyone in the race. A Boise Mayor Lauren McLean has endorsed Democratic candidate Mayor Pete Buttigieg. Next Saturday, the former mayor from South Bend, Indiana, is expected to visit Boise for a town hall event. Details of the time and location have not yet been announced. Early voting for the March 10th election is underway in several Idaho counties, and it's a good time for unregistered voters or voters who need to update their registration to do so. Canyon County voters will have to go to the Canyon County Elections Office on Chicago Street, and voters in Ada County can cast their ballots at the Elections Office on Benjamin Lane, Boise City Hall, or Meridian City Hall. A mobile voting center We'll also be stopping at locations around the county through the March 6th the deadline. If you want to see a list of those locations, just click on this story on our website, sixonyourside.com.